Since 2016, Highland Springs and Manchester have been two of the more successful programs in the old central region. What Coach Hall has done over there, and then what we're trying to do over here, you know, kind of replicates itself or, or, or duplicates itself or mirrors each other. They are the true measuring stick of every school, I think, not just in our area, but in the state of Virginia. Between them, they've played in nine regional finals, made five state championship appearances, and won four state titles. It's the team that's prepared. They do a phenomenal job of preparing every aspect of the game. And it's good to just watch good football, right? They've, they've done so many things that have not been done in the past. Um, just, again, uh, and, and our program being mentioned uh, with them, I'm, I'm very honored. Um, I'm very flattered. But facing each other in the regular season has been few and far between. It's fun to even think about playing Manchester this time around. Um, definitely after what happened in the spring. Being in a situation where now you get to play in a key mark, you know, a, a huge game to start out the year, I mean, it's nothing better. In our game of the week, the top two teams in our coaches poll will meet in a rare regular season matchup at Highland Springs. It's one of those situations where it's, it's a friendly rivalry, right? It's, 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 going, it's competitive as hell. Everybody wants to win the ball game, but you know, you don't get it at its height all the time. I believe it's two similar programs that, that are both built on the rock. You know, that, that there's a story in the Bible when the, if you build a house on the rock, the rock, the, the, the house stands, you know, no matter what storms come. And, and, and I like to look at it that way. Um, it's, it's one of these games that, that uh, I, I think the, the whole Richmond area is gonna look forward to come out and seeing this week. Friday marks just the second regular season meeting between the two schools since 1965. And if you count Highland Springs' playoff win back in 78, they've won the last three meetings against the Lancers. Reporting for the Game of the Week, I'm Sean Robertson, CBS 6 Sports.